Have no fear, have no fear. The king of the dinosaurs is here. That would be me. Tyrannosaurus Rex, which actually means Tyrant Lizard King. And, well, that's me. <laughs> and did you know that a full-grown T-Rex, like myself, ta-da, is more than 12 meters in length? That's longer than a school bus. And when I stand up to my full height, I'm taller than a double-decker bus. The Tyrannosaurus Rexes weigh more than seven tons, you know. And I have the most beautiful teeth. Would you like to see them? Most vegetable-eating dinosaurs have small, bumpy teeth for chewing and grinding leaves and plants. But, well, you see, I am a carnivore. Uh, that means meat eater, uh, yum, 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 yum. And my teeth are perfect for, well, there's simply no other way to put this, for eating other dinosaurs. And the best part is once my teeth get a little worn down, they're automatically replaced. It really is a tremendous honor being king of the dinosaurs. 65 million years ago, we T-Rexes ruled the world, especially these parts of North America. Here. Well, I'd simply love to stay and chat with you all some more, but, you see, my subjects need me, and I need them, because it's lunchtime! Oh, dear. Gotcha! Scared you, didn't I? Well, that's because I'm an afro -venator. That means African hunter. Pretty impressive, huh? But don't be worried. I won't hunt you. Watch me hunt that Jobaria. He won't see me coming and he'll be so scared. Oh, he's gone. Well... That's okay. I'm not that hungry. It wasn't like I was going to eat him in front of you. There really is no trick to hunting. You just have to look. Take that Chubaria, for example. He's huge. Very easy to spot. Perfect. But you know, you don't need to be 10 meters long with a mouthful of sharp teeth and three claws on each hand to be a hunter like me. For instance, you could hunt to find where in the world we are right now. Africa, that's right. There was also a clue in my name. Did you get that? Afro, meaning I'm from what's now known as Africa. Or you could hunt for fossils, like Paul Sereno, who found a nearly complete fossil of me in Niger in 1993. What a find! Someone who hunts for fossils is called a paleontologist. Ooh. Please excuse me. Gotcha! Come back and see me next week. I will teach you how to use your nails to comb your hair. Ah, you have come to the late Jurassic period in search of the great and powerful Compsonathus. That's Compsonathus. It's very easy if you practice. Ow! Hey, Bavariosaurus! Did you hear what they're saying about me? I am the number one land predator in these islands in the depth of sea. It's true! No dinosaur gets past me. Why, well, see these legs? They are long and slender, which helps me to run very, very fast. You are so full of hot air. I'm surprised you don't float away. Do you dare insult me, the mighty Gomsonathus? I can eat any lizard, dinosaur, or fish I want. Any one. I was the first complete dinosaur fossil that scientists could study. You, you see? see? Again, Again, I was I first. Was first. Num -num Number one. one. Bring in the size chart. Okay, so I'm on the small side. So what? I'm still number one. Excuse me while I go and show our friend why I'm number one. 
Oh, you think I cannot climb? Well, you are wrong. My bones, they're hollow like a bird's, which means I'm light. And, oh yeah, see this tail? It'll help me stay balanced. You can run, but you can't hide because I am the magnificent Compsonathus! All right, team. Here we are in the late Jurassic period, 150 million years ago. You know me. I'm Coach Stegosaurus. You can say my name. Stegosaurus! 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 That's the herbivore spirit? Okay, let's go over our equipment. Get in line. Great, let's see those plates. Now, that's not really enough armor, but they do make the carnivorous dinos think twice about taking a bite out of us. These plates actually let us be warmer or colder, depending on how much we point them at the sun. Hey, an Allosaurus. Let's see those stagomizers. Yes, those stagomizers at the end of our tails are the real deal. Those spikes are up to 1.2 meters long. And we need them where we're from, what is now known as the Midwestern United States. In fact, we're Colorado State Fossil. All right, team. No one's gonna mess with us, right? Stegosaurus! 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 Rah, rah, rah! We're pretty big, the size of a bus. Are you ready, Stegosaurus? That's great, team. Stegosaurus! Stegosaurus! the late Cretaceous period 70 million years ago. I'm a Gorgosaurus. That's Gorgosaurus. Mom? No? They're gonna think I'm just a kid. I can't wait till I get big. I'm going to be even scarier than my mom over there. Cause that's what my name means, Fearsome Lizard. I'm not as tall as she is yet, but one day I'll be nine meters long. I'll be as long as a house. Gorgosaurus like me, Tyrannosaurus? Phew, that's a big word. But it has to be big, just like us. Imagine, we're in the same dino family with T-Rex. See all the sharp teeth? We're meat eaters, and our teeth help us chew even the toughest meat. I'm from what is now known as Alberta, Canada. So when I get fully grown, watch out. If you want to get big, you have to eat a good meal. And I've already called you for lunch four times. Yes, Mom. Gotta go eat. See you later. I'm Panopolosaurus. That's pan o plo -saurus. I wonder if you can guess what my name means. Welcome to our game show. Guess the meaning of my name. Clue number one. I live here in the late Cretaceous period, 74 million years ago. No guesses? Okay. I'm from the family of dinos called Ankylosauria. That means I have body armor. I have a stiff, clubless tail. And look at all my spikes. I'm built like an armored truck. Any ideas? Uh, square root of four. Uh, uh, five by eight. Uh, pi. This is an easy clue. I'm the same size as a dump truck. And I weigh three and a half metric tons. The same as an elephant. Of course, all of this armor is to protect me from meat eaters like these two T-Rexes. 
Okay. This is the last clue, and then you'll have to answer. I live in what is now Alberta, Canada. So can you guess what my name means? Does it mean delicious? No. Panoplosaurus means totally armored lizard. Look at all the armor on me. Sheesh. Do I win something? No. Hey, play nice. I gave you easy clues. Oh well. See you next time. Oops, sorry about that. I thought that he might be hiding in there. Oh, by the way, I'm Mega Raptor. That's Mega Raptor. You may have noticed that I'm in a bit of a rush. So I haven't got a whole lot of time to chat. Aha! Uh -huh. Hey, wait a sec! Come back here! I'm as tall as a diving board. if you can help me with something. It's Mother's Day, and I have no idea what to get my mum. Do you have any ideas? A bag of nuts! That would be a great idea. But nope, she hates nuts. We're carnivores, and we don't eat plants. That's a great idea! Happy Mother's Day, Mom! <sighs> Hi there! I was just saying hello to the sun. You wait right here, babies. Mom is just gonna go talk to these folks for a minute. I'm Gallimimus. That's ga li mim mus My name means chicken mimic. A mimic is someone who copies someone else, but I don't think I copy a chicken at all. I'd like to know what chicken is as long as me, from the top of my head to the tip of my tail. I'm almost as long as a big car. Hey, where'd you go? Oh, sorry, I didn't see you there. You see, even though I have these really big, pretty eyes, I can't tell how far away things are, or even things right in front of me. I have to look sideways, like this. My babies! Oh, this is so exciting. I wonder what they'll be. <gasps> Baby Gallimimuses, just what I wished for. Well, I better start feeding them. Bye! Oh, yeah. So good. Love it. You should taste these plants and grass. It's so good. Oh, excuse my manners. My name is... So hungry. Oh, yeah, my name is Brachiosaurus. Wow, I'm hungry. Yes, I know I don't look a kilogram over 60 tons, but I'm still growing. I'll get to be about 16 meters tall. Yeah. 
Anyway, I think there's a force over there I can eat. After all, I'd eat my 200 kilograms of food a day. Aren't you scared of me? All dinosaurs are scared of the Allosaurus. No, no, I'm a Brachiosaurus, a plant-eating dinosaur. I'm a herbivore. Bye. Hmm, all this talk of food is making me really hungry. The herd! Yay! I thought I lost you guys. Excuse me while I join my herd. Oh, I'm lost again. Hey, look, a delicious forest. Hi, I'm Massospondylus. You say it like this. Massospondylus. I'm trying to think of what I can do for the Dino Talent Show. It helps to have hands that let me grab things or I'd never be able to do this. <laughs> my name means massive vertebra. Those are the bones in my neck. Here, take a look. Now that's a lot of neck. I live in what is now called South Africa. I'm about the same size as an elephant, but I weigh a lot less because my bones are hollow and I have air sacs that make me lighter. That's how I can be so light on my feet. I know. I could tap dance in for the talent show. Hmm, maybe not dancing. Oh, I know. I love to sing. Listen. La 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 la. Well, what do you think of my singing? I guess I need to practice more. I wish there was something else I could do for the Dino Talent Show. Something I was good at. Oh well, I'm sure it'll come to me. See you at the talent show. 